Catholic Daily Mass Readings June 17, 2023 Memorial of the Immaculate Heart of Mary A reading from the second letter of St. Paul to the Corinthians Brothers and sisters, the love of Christ impels us once we have come to the conviction that one died for all. Therefore, all have died. He indeed died for all, so that those who live might no longer live for themselves, but for him who for their sake died and was raised. Consequently, from now on, we regard no one according to the flesh. Even if we once knew Christ according to the flesh, yet now we know him so no longer. So whoever is in Christ is a new creation. The old things have passed away. Behold, new things have come. And all this is from God, and who has reconciled us to himself through Christ and given us the ministry of reconciliation, namely, God was reconciling the world to himself in Christ not counting their trespasses against them, and entrusting to us the message of reconciliation. So we are ambassadors for Christ, as if God were appealing through us. We implore you on behalf of Christ, be reconciled to God. For our sake he made him to be seen who did not know sin so that we might become the righteousness of God in Him. For we do not preach ourselves, but Jesus Christ as Lord, and ourselves as your slaves for the sake of Jesus. For God who said, Let light shine out of darkness, has shone in our hearts to bring to light the knowledge of the glory of God on the face of Jesus Christ. The Word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Responsorial Psalm, let our response be, The Lord is kind and merciful. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and all my being, bless His holy name. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and forget not all His benefits. The Lord is kind and merciful. He pardons all your iniquities. He heals all your ills. He crowns you with kindness and compassion. The Lord is kind and merciful. He will not always chide, nor does He keep His wrath forever. Not according to our sins does He deal with us nor does he requite us according to our crimes. The Lord is kind and merciful. For as the heavens are high above the earth, so surpassing is his kindness toward those who fear him. As far as the east is from the west, so far has he put our transgressions from us. The Lord is kind and merciful. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Luke. Each year, Jesus' parents went to Jerusalem for the Feast of Passover. And when he was twelve years old, they went up according to festival custom. After they had completed his days as they were returning, the boy Jesus remained behind in Jerusalem, but his parents did not know it. Thinking that he was in the caravan, they journeyed for a day, and looked for him among the relatives and acquaintances, but not finding him. They returned to Jerusalem to look for him. After three days, they found him in the temple, sitting in the midst of the teachers, listening to them and asking them questions. And all who heard him were astounded at his understanding and his answers. When his parents saw him, they were astonished, 
And his mother said to him, Son, why have you done this to us? Your father and I have been looking for you with great anxiety. And he said to them, Why were you looking for me? Did you not know that I must be in my father's house? But they did not understand what he said to them. He went down with them and came to Nazareth and was obedient to them. And his mother kept all these things in her heart. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ.